Our next question is, I'm really nervous about my math grade. I currently have a C minus, but I'm worried that it might drop to a D with the final. What happens if I get a D in class? Well, let's take this one step at a time. First, let's see what we can do to avoid the D. Go talk to your math teacher and ask what you can do to prevent the D. What do you need to study? Is there extra credit that you can do? Can you retake any assignments or tests from the past to bring your grade up? If your math teacher tells you that there's a very high chance that you will get a D with the final, go talk to your counselor. Ask if it's possible to still drop the course without any penalty on your transcript. You may get a W and that's okay. That's much better than a D. You can then retake the course either through summer school, online, or even next year. If your counselor says that you cannot drop the course and you have to stay, go talk to your math teacher again and let her know that you will be taking the course. You're going to work as hard as possible to keep your grade up. And do that. Work as hard as possible. Talk to your parents about what you can do to bring your grade up. You might want to get a tutor to help you with those concepts that are extremely difficult. Go to your math tutor during tutorial or study hall. Talk to your friends who've taken the course and see if you can get help from them. Drill yourself on problems as much as you can every single night to make sure you understand as much of the math as possible. If you get the D, it's okay. It's not the end of the world and you can still get into college. What you'll want to do is you'll want to retake the course. And again, you can do that through summer school, you can do that through online, and you can retake the course at your high school. Talk to your counselor about which courses will qualify for the repeat grade. Most high schools will consider a D a passing grade, so they will often let you move up to the next level of math. Colleges, however, do not consider a D a passing grade, so you want to make sure that you do retake it as soon as possible, and that way you don't have to worry about it down the road. And just one piece of advice. While you can retake the course and get the D, the D won't count in your GPA, it will remain on your transcript. So colleges will still see it, but they'll see the repeated course as well. And they will take into account the new grade that you got as part of the GPA. And that's really important to know. Many students think that when they retake the course that the D will automatically disappear from their transcript, and that's not the case. But that's okay. You, as you, when you send in your college applications, you should write a little note about what happened in the math class. In your college admissions GPA calculation, the grade that you took, the repeated grade that you took, will be the grade that counts in the calculation. So while the D will show up on the transcript, if you got a B when you retook the course, the B is what will get calculated. So don't fret about the D on your transcript. Colleges certainly will not.